I like the last sentence at the end of the paragraph about mathematical practice number one, make sense of problems and persevere in solving them. It says, perseverance develops when students feel as though they have a way into a problem and other approaches to try when their initial solution strategy comes to a dead end. Uh, perseverance is an awesome skill to have not just in math but in life and if through teaching math we can teach students to persevere when things get difficult to not give up and sink but to just keep swimming just keep swimming just keep swimming just keep swimming that would be awesome I wanted to show this problem from the reading to my neighbor Finn across the street he's in seventh grade and just yesterday I was helping him with his math homework uh, dealing with linear equations. So let's see how he tackles this. This is confusing. So can we make this n? Yeah, sure. Okay. So if she's running n amount of days. I think if you should change all the d's to n though. Okay. Yeah, it's kind of confusing when it says d and then day. Okay. So it just kind of... Yeah. With my brain, it... Yeah, it's... So if she has... She's run, say, however many days. So that's four laps per each of those days. Mm -hmm. So it's uh, it's 4D minus 800. Because it's four times whatever the amount of days. Well, it would be that minus. It would be 800 minus the other day. Okay. How, can you explain again how you knew it was A? Uh, so, if you have n amount of days, or a variable, any variable, mm -hmm. so any of any amount of days times 4, which is how many laps she wants to run each day, then you, mul well, I mean, however many days that is, you multiply 4 by that amount of days, and then you take 800, which is her goal, and subtract however many she's done to see how many she has left. Cool. So I think based on what Finn showed us that he was using MP7, uh, look for it and make use of structure. But it was interesting that after I stopped the video and we talked a little more about it, and I showed him uh, this part from the chapter and what I was doing, uh, he looked at Roberto's strategy, which uses the mathematical practice eight, look for and express regularity and repeated reasoning and said that that's uh, what he'd done in his head at the start. He plugged in 10 days and came up with 40 laps, and then that was kind of the thing that, that got him uh, thinking in the uh, more structural way, which is just interesting how all of these things overlap and cascade into one another.